Yo, what is going on guys and welcome back to my VRL CF um, FIFA 19 career mode series. We are on episode 8 now of our streamed uh, series. We are in the first season and I do want to apologise for not um, streaming the last few days. I just haven't, f like, I just didn't feel up to it, I'm, I'm not going to lie. And um, But I wanted to get back into it and I... Well, I have done. Obviously, you might remember la at the end of the last episode, we did make it to January. We only had two games in the last episode because I just want feeling uh, doing f uh, free matches. Um, but into today's stream, we are going to be doing free matches and that we are going to have our away tie against Ibar, which we should have had last stream, but I just decided not to. And then we've got two cup ties in the Copa de España. Um, against Getafe home and away so it's going to be good but also as well as that we are, because we are in January we are going to be trying to look to do some business and as you can see our transfer budget right now isn't the greatest so it looks like we'll have to offload uh, players before we can actually bring anyone in so um, stay with us for that but like I said in the last um, at the end of last stream, I was honestly considering getting rid of um, Gerard Moreno. He hasn't done well for us this season, so I have. Um, so we want to be getting rid of him and bringing a new striker. And I have added quite a few more strikers to our like shortlist, um, I guess. Um, obviously, um, also in the last stream, we did um, agree a deal um, to get Andreas Pereira from Manchester United on a free transfer at the end of the season. Talking about the end of the season, right now, I honestly, I won't lie to you guys, even though I am absolutely loving being VRL manager, I do want to try out like a different team in a different country. My first choice destination right now would be Italy. Um, even though it's not a licensed um, league as such like La Liga in this FIFA where there are um, loads of uh, stadiums and it's not even like the match presentation like that as in La Liga or uh, MLS for instance or obviously England it is a country that like I do want to go to and the team that like I've always liked and I would like to become their manager is AC Milan in recent years I'd probably say the fallen giant of um, Italy but anyway like enough about that I want to know your guys' opinion if you're watching this in, within the stream or if you're watching this as a video when it gets posted. Where would you like to see me go next? Obviously, I am in Europa League this season and if I do decide to stay, then I have the prospect of being in the Champions League next season. So, it is crucial you guys give me your opinion and I will take them on board. It's not just about me. It's about where, um, what sort of teams you'd want me to go to because at the end of the day, it is... Um, as a collective it's a few different things including is the job going to be available for me to apply for are they going to accept um, my application and offer me the job it's a few different things but anyway at the end of the last stream we did try and look at getting Morata and try a straight swap deal between himself and Moreno um, I know both of them are around 26 mil worth um, but as well as the 26 mils were for Moreno, they wanted 26 mil on top of that, so it would be worth 52 mil. Like, I like Morata, I would like to use him more in this FIFA, but saying that, I, I'm not going to pay up to 52 mil. I would I'd do a straight swap, I think that would be fine because both of them are E3 rated, both of them about the same sort of age. It like it would be it, financially it would make sense, but anyway. But we've added a few more like strikers that we could look at. I've added an Aki Williams, but it, because he is at Sevilla and he started this season at Athletic Bilbao, that would be unlikely. Um, also, maybe Bolotti, um, same sort of price range and um, overall rating as Gerard Moreno from Torino. Definitely a player I want to look at. Interesting one of Falcao. Would it be good in the second half of the season for us? Uh, it's just an option. Depay is doing very well in real life uh, for um, Leon. He'll be an interesting one. Um, Origi, I believe he's on loan at um, Newcastle, so I'm not really going to take much interest. And then a couple, a few like cheap ones. Gabbiadini is not really a player I've used much in FIFA, and I'd like to have a look at him. But Hernandez would be like a good cheap option, who I would honestly believe would get goals. Um, there are a few things that I'm not too keen about, but the 84 finishing from it does look very good. And we've got like Lacadia from um, Brighton, not a player I've like used much at all in FIFA. 
it would be an interesting one. But anyway, we don't have any money at the moment, so we'll have more look into that once we've got scout reports back. Let's get into our first game, and there's a player unavailable in my team. Oh, I remember that Sanchez got injured um, towards the end of the last stream. Uh, let's put in Teo and then put in Morales into midfield and put, push Taliso to the other side. And let's take... We did actually um, recall Soriano from Torino, I believe. So maybe he's got connections with Bellotti. Maybe he might be able to have that friendship and persuade him to come to um, the Yellow Submarines. That would be interesting. But yeah, I'm kind of I'm happy with that. I think it's about four or five weeks that Sanchez is out for. It's, it's not a great thing to happen because he's had a very solid half of the season for us. But like I say, like at the moment I shouldn't really be thinking about where my next destination is because we're only like halfway through the season. But anyway, we have our game against Ibar and I really don't really want to see it raining. Um, we have a game in midweek and then we have a, ga a game a week after that. So it should be okay. Um, our squad doesn't look bad at all. I'm happy with that. The one thing is though, I need to get back used to this team. I've been playing m probably more with my ultimate team of late. I've just been playing uh, mate, uh, just playing games against mates and stuff. Um, and really haven't played much career mode series against um, the computer. So it might take me a while to get into it. I have to remember we are still unbeaten in this series and in this season. So. Let's see if we can stretch that further. We haven't drawn in a long time either. But anyway, we are looking at the best player that I've signed by far this season. And he is the top goal scorer in La Liga at the moment. And that is Antonio Sanabria from Real Betis. He's been absolutely remarkable for us. Oh, I like this little stadium. Great scenery in the background. This is a nice little stadium. Got a, like It looks like a block of flats to the right-hand side. I bet anyone living there has got a good view down onto the pitch. This is a nice little... This is actually a very nice little goal. 14 goals scored and 40 goals scored. So the worst in the league versus the best. So with that being said, we should win pretty darn easily. So hopefully we can get that win. And I, I can't remember how many games it is that Sanabria has scored. And I honestly believe it's like 14, 15 games. But I'm not really going to focus on that. If he scores, he scores. Actually, did he score in his last game? I feel like he went a game but he actually didn't score. I don't know. Anyway, let's uh, focus because goal records are all very well and good, but at the same time, we want to be winning. Costa, I know who has got four goals this season. That was a nice little start by him. Morales, can he get his first away goal of the season? No, he can't. Playing more central role now for VRL as um, Renato Sanchez is injured. Obviously, I'm starting Teo, who hasn't been impressive this season, but at the same time, I want to keep faith in him. And um, is he a player that's going to go forward and like be a name to remember in this series? Well, he could be a name to remember in this match if he scores. He's put it wide. What is wrong with the finishing? Is that oh, it is a save at least? At least he didn't like just miss. So now we're going up for it. Comes out to the edge of the box. Alvaro, I ah, just cut into traffic. I thought it was Costa at the start, so that's why I got it onto his left foot. But not the worst start ever. We've got had a few chances. Teo maybe should have had his uh, first goal in a long time. Got a ball here through to Vasquez. Great um, save by Dimitrovic. Is that his name? <laughs> Quite a low ball in from... Um, Morales but it was Dante the ex Bayern Munich and Nice defender um, doing well there Teo good turn from you cut back can he get it to Snabry oh Snabry tries to get on his right foot but unfortunately he can't do so Taliso and Gaspar working well but unfortunately Taliso um, loses the ball is that good Munson from Burnley I want to say I think I recognised the face at the start, but I just couldn't put a name to the face. But that would honestly make sense if it was. Costa's going forward. Obviously, we know how much of a threat he is. Tries a shot. Gives it to Sanabria. Sanabria going for the curler and again by the keeper. Good shot. We've had six shots in this first 22 um, minutes. Can we, Pedro Leon getting it out. Ibarra might be a smaller team in Spain, but they've definitely got a bit of character about them. And that's what I really do like. Good ball there, Sanabria. He is onside. Can he get another shot? It got past the goalkeeper, but the defender says no. Taliso winning the back beautifully there. 
Costa into Ndidi. Can he get it to Morales? Morales out to side two. Gaspar, no, can't. It's fed back to the not fed back to the game, not feeded. That's not proper English, James. Anyway, Sanabria. Sanabria going for the kill. He was probably turning a bit away from goal. Maybe should have done better though with the form he's been in of late. Do I see Gerard Moreno playing again for VRL? I honestly believe he'll come on um, in this game and probably play some parts against um, <coughs> Getafe. Actually, I might play Sanabria fully in this game, and then Moreno fully in the next game, and then Sanabria fully in the game after that. That's something that I, it's an option I could do. Here comes Lucas Vasquez. Definitely, we've seen improvement in this uh, series with him. But well defended there by Coat. I thought that's the name. Sanabria going up for it, aiming it towards that near post. Does work on create. Works less so against your mates, I can tell you that much. Well done by Ibar then to get the ball out. But the passing so far has been good. 88% has been very efficient. It's just And we've created chances. It's not like we've done like jack shit, really. <laughs> I was, I was trying to think of a way to say, um, I was going to say bugger all, and then I thought, you know what, I'm going to swear. <laughs> I'm not a person that gets monetized anyway, I don't earn that much. Okay, approaching half time, I've just noticed. Ivar, like with most teams, they've got into the game um, alright, but... They are the lowest scorers in the league, so may, um, well, I'm not going to like disrespect them and say, oh, they're not going to score, because any team can score against us. So it's like just a matter of will power. But Ibar are definitely a team that are impressing me so far. Rully comes out, comes to collect. Escalante. And it is a free kick to Ibar just before half time. The allotted two minutes of added time are up. But time is trying to take that. Rolly collects. He kicks it out. Should be half time. It is. So obviously we're, I'm trying to get you back used to this series and, and how it like works and how I'm doing. Um, but yeah, it, we haven't been too bad. We haven't been shocking. We've created a couple of chances, a couple of clear chances we should have taken. But at the end of the day, we haven't conceded. We're still unbeaten. Let's. Um, try and enjoy our football as well as try and create some good chances We've got Teo he wants to he's trying to cook up a storm here uh, he just ran back into traffic and that is that probably sums up his time at VRL right now obviously a player with a lot of uh, had a lot of potential going up oh trying to get it through then Arabella or Arabella or Arab Ar Ar Arbilla <laughs> I don't know what his name is good Munson good turn I believe, yeah, I, I can even see from it. It is the good Munson I was on about. Cavaselli doing well to block the shot. Goes out for Ibar's first corner of the game. Arbilla, that's it. <laughs> I thought it said Arabella, then it's Arabella, then it's Arbilla. <laughs> okay. Good little ball through to Toledo, but Vasquez didn't really want to run then, which was a bit of shame got a few that aren't willing to run right now and it just goes straight to the keeper not great not great lads seriously need to do a lot better okay it's a good ball but Rully is alive to it had a very good half a season so far a lot like one thought I was like thinking before I started the stream is say I do go to it. Let's say I go to AC Milan. Do, do I bring anyone from Vera? I'd, I'd say there's definitely uh, well, a couple of names I could definitely bring. Like Sanabria would be top of that list. If I need like a goal scorer that can get me goals, then yeah, he's my man. Is there someone like Sanchez? Sanchez would be decent. I'd say Toliso would be expensive. Um, so it would be tough to justify um, that I don't know what the budgets are for and I don't know who AC Milan have signed themselves to like sell on or whatnot so Sanabria with a shot oh good save and Dimitrovic does well aim towards that near post again Pedro Leon away 
back out to the wing to Morales. Morales with a deep across. Comes out to Tolisso. Tolisso has the shot. Comes to Sanabria. What can you do? We have shots, but... Okay, what can we do from here? Costa. Oh, that's poor. We're approaching the last 15 minutes and we're struggling in this game. You can definitely tell it's been a few days since I played this. But there is a ball through to Cardona. Should have done better then. We got let off then because they could have taken the lead from that if they just decided to shoot. Oh, I saw the ball through there, but Sanabri is having a bit of an off game. I do apologise to him and the rest of this VRL team. I've slacked. Slacked off a bit. Into the feet of Lucas to Tolisso. Costa on the overlap. What can he do? Cuts inside. Gives it to Tolisso. Oh, that, that was the chance. Keeper has been very good in this game. Uh, there's no denying that. He has actually pulled off some amazing saves. Into Tolisso. Into Vasquez. Gaspar's on the overlap. We're in the last five minutes now. To Vasquez. Oh, that's just poor. And look at this. The counter that It's three on three at the moment. Out wide. Cavaselli's trying to make up the ground. It's... Oh, my God. Cardona beat um, Alvaro to the ball then. I don't know where, where my defenders are. That was a good inception. That was a much needed inception. Can we make one more chance? Snabber, a good turn. Managed to get away from the player then. Into Morales. Into Tolisso. Come on, Teo has got the chat. No. Oh my god. He is the worst. I need to see his finishing. There's not going to be any easier chances than that. Finish. It's finishing 74. What's his composure? 66. Eh, that would probably be about right, actually. Oh, I'm very disappointed with that because it means we're going to be drawing this game. He's let us all down. And that is it. A nil nil draw away at Ibar. It isn't good. Um, the only positive is really we're still unbeaten. But if you look at those stats, 17 shots, 11 on target, yeah. That's nearly double what we average in this series per game. Very disappointing. Best chances fall into, uh, fall into Christian Tao. Just wasn't able to take it. Such a shame. But anyway, we move on. We move on as we mean to go on. I think that's the saying. Something like that. Looks like Sanabria has gone up to an 82 rated. First time in a long while that he hasn't scored. It is a shame. It is a crying shame. Okay. Um, Espinosa's back from loan. Leon was disappointed to start. Well, I'm sorry, mate. I am sorry. It's it's a problem when you've got so like. I wish, because it's halfway through the season, it should realistically let me list him. But I don't know. I don't know indeed. We'll just have to wait and see on that one. But anyway, we go into the second game of the episode because we can't do much else up with that. And it is a way to Getafe in the first leg of the Copa de España. I can't remember what round. Uh, we're playing the pink here. Why not? I've been using it a bit on Ultimate Team as well, so I do like it. Anyway, we do need to make changes to this team because it just didn't it didn't really do well. Lopez is going to come in, so is Juan Jesus. Uh, Leon is going to come in for Gaspar. Got Lamina in for Morales. Soriano is going to actually play his first game back from his loan spell with Torino on the left-hand side. Um, and Moreno is going to start up top. Vasquez is also going to come out for Munir. Very happy with that team. We've got some players on the bench that aren't the 
most unfit so they've got a chance of playing some part let's get into this game and hopefully get our first win of the episode <sighs> I have missed this series though I will say this right now for like it's not that I didn't want to do it it's just that I wasn't feeling fully up for it and I, I need to be in a certain mood in order to do it otherwise I feel like oh it's gonna be a slog we're done say like I would have got through one game and thought, oh, can I just end it here? Can I just get away with one match? But no. But right now, I'm I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Obviously, we want goals. You guys are expecting goals. I'm expecting goals. We are top of La Liga. It seems Nathaniel Klein is lining up for Getafe. Some weird transfers happen in this series and in transfer, well, in career mode in general. It's just a thing that happens. But anyway, let's see what we can do. Good ball in. Alvaro gets away, but is that Mario Gomez? No, it's a different sort of Gomez. It, I don't think Getafe have a proper, like, a licensed stadium. Alright. We need to get into a groove. We need to put team press on. Just how I roll. Good turn by Gerard Moreno. Can he get it through to Monet? No, he can't. He was blocked off by a defender. Good inception, though, by that defender. Cantalisa gets head on that. He didn't even challenge for it. What is is like? Is this going to be the turning point in the series? But here's Monet, and Monet's put it wide. What is wrong with my finishing? Somehow it was saved. I didn't see anything to do with like a save or anything. What a shame this has been so far. But the thing is, I would be more disappointed if we weren't making any chances at all. It's the fact that we are like putting our bodies online. We are giving it ourselves a good chance. Sorry, I know it's first touch for VRL. Back of the club. It was a bit of a disappointing one. Not going to lie. Okay. Here we go. Here we go, boys. Here we go. Well done by Alvaro then. Good touch by Taliso to get past his man. Monet. Oh, what a poor return ball to him. That is a foul, unfortunately. I just couldn't get the ball in. Instead, just got nothing but man. And man fouled man. Good header by Gabamin. I don't know how you would say that now. Alright. Into Leon. Into Lamina. Into Taliso. Into Gerard Moreno. Playing for his future, of course. That was pretty poor. Comes to Moreno again. Just can't keep hold of it. Lack of space in this game. Okay. Alvaro. Indeedy. Taliso. Oh, saw uh, Leon on the over. Uh, yeah, on the overlap. Got ball through to Mata, not the Mata you're thinking of. Mata's kept hold of it. To the back stick. Okay, first of all, with um, Costa, I press square and to the left, so that means up the pitch. And then. Who, who was that? Was that Lamina that scored the own goal? It was. Jesus Christ, guys. We're playing a horrible in this stream. Is this going to be our first loss? Bloody hopes. Ho hope not. <laughs> Back to Moreno. Oh, we just don't have that threat. Well done by Klein there. That was a soppy goal. Mono battling, but he just can't win possession of the ball. Vergara. Costa. Alright, come on. Let's start to build again. Don't l forget about it. Pretend it's nil nil. Leon. I was trying to get that to Money. What is wrong with my like directional play? Portillo. What can we do from this position though? Lamina, can you redeem yourself? No, it's wide. These are like chances that you should be at least putting on target. That's such a letdown. Such a letdown. Okay. 
That's well done. That's well done. Indeed, he did well there, Moreno. You know, Moreno, he's got a chance here. He's still got it. Maybe. Oh. Right now, we deserve to be losing. This is not a team that I look at and think, you know what? We're top of the league. Jesus Christ. We'd be struggling mid table. Bottom off for sure at this stage. Gets out to Leon. He's a willing runner, that's what I like. Monet. Poor, poor. Get out of. You paid good money to uh, do better, really. Gerard Moreno with the curler. At least it's on target. There's a bit. Right, second half, we need to be so much better, otherwise, we risk our first loss of this series. Into Moreno. Into Monet. Monet, just have a shot. Nice. Can we get a corner? No, it's not going to go out. But it is going to go out for half time. Not good enough. Not good enough at all. I want to say Monet has been quite a problem so far. Sorry, Arno, we have not seen anything of him, but I am going to keep him on for now. Moreno needs to do more. He's only scored six goals this season, and you can see why. This team, though. Right. Gets it out to Soriano. Cuts in, but he just loses the ball. Okay, at least we won it back straight from a throw in. Toliso. Okay, Leon. Didi. Lamina on his left foot. Can't do much. Just into a. Just a wall of blue shirted bodies. Getafe right now are doing decent. There's n no way to say any different. They're actually doing decent. I wouldn't say they're playing great, but they're doing everything that's expected of them. And honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if they got a second right now. And yeah, we're 2-0 down. What is happening? This is our first loss of the series, guys. I'm sorry, but it is going to be. Unless we have like an almighty comeback, which after 57 minutes, I just want to go home. I am home, but I mean like in game. This is a bad away travel. Not only can we struggle to get back in this game, but we might actually struggle to get back in this tie right now. I'm glad it's two, over two legs, but look at that. How sloppy and lethargic and slow. We have been awful. There is nothing anyone can do to make me feel better right now. Oh my god, they've hit the post. And on the re they, They've probably had more shots than as simple as that. I might have to bring on Sanabria because Moreno is just dog shit. Right. Lamina. That's alright. Don't mind that. Overlap by Costa. Someone that's probably willing to work. Gives it to Lamina. Taliso does well to turn. Gives it into Ndidi. Soriano, what can you do? There's not much space, granted. Gerard Moreno, on your right foot. You're just a bag of wank. Alvaro is not winning headers. That's nice, Lamina. I like that intent to win it back. Now it's Vasquez into Moreno. Moreno going for the curl. It's gone up for a corner. We need to get a goal in this game. Alvaro, you've got to get to that quicker. Right, here we go. Start again. Into Lamina. Into Moreno. Moreno, trying to turn. Tries to shoot, it's gone wide. I like the idea, I like the idea, but... We need a goal scorer. But I just don't want to bring on Sanabria in this game. Right, we've got a counter here. Well, now they've got the defence back, so... Good counter, lads. Oh, Jesus Christ. Right. Taliso. That's a foul. Surely. Referee. 
That's a travesty. Moreno's got scored. He has scored. We've got 12 minutes to, to get back into this game. I'd, I'd happily take a two-all draw right now. 100%. Stay unbeaten. But the thing is, I bet anything we don't get many chances at all in the remainder of this game. But that was well worked and Moreno getting his seventh goal of the season. Is that enough to keep him at the club? No. <laughs> First chance I get to sell him, he's gone. Oh, come on, lads. This is what I mean. You were not going to get even a chance. Oh, my. I think that's actually the first goal anyway that Diego Lopez has conceded. Maybe he's just playing bad on purpose because he knows he wants out. But he's well paid to do jack shit, so he should be happy. All right, Moreno. Vasquez. Need runners now. Out wide to Moreno. He's actually played very well in the second half. It's got that's a foul, yes. Okay, we've got two minutes. Like I said, we haven't had a shot since we scored. Alright, can we get it into someone? Back to Vasquez. To Ndidi. Lamina, can you get past your man? No, you can't. Into Taliso. Soriano! Soriano! No! It's, that's it. That's going to be it. Uh, Havara just hasn't gone for a header at all in this game. What a ball. Vasquez. Moreno! Alright, we've got a corner. We've got to score, otherwise we've lost. Put it in their post. Oh, it's going to be over. It is over. It is our first loss of the series. In this game, in this episode, we've drawn one and lost one. <sighs> I've got a decision to make here. Do I end it here because I'm just playing badly? Or do I try and suck it up and go again at home, second leg against Getafe in the cup? But as you can see right now, We've got our first loss after 27 games. Very disappointing. Very disappointing. I'm going to think in the next minute or so if I'm going to be doing this next match. Um, the way I look at it right now is I'm playing so do I think I can improve for these this next game I don't know you know two games in a row have been bad you know what I've, I've decided and this is like for what's happening now on every episode is gonna have two games so it's gonna be like um, like you can see other series where they just do two games an episode but maybe they like edit it up I'm just gonna have two games an episode keep it nice and sweet so guys if you did enjoy the shorter episode this disappointing episode where we didn't even pick up a win be sure to leave that like rating but if you want to subscribe and see how we do in the future also um, take that into consideration also um, I asked if you wanted me to look elsewhere at the moment, there's three jobs that have been advertised. PSG, mad. We've got Atletico Madrid, great team. 60 mil. They've got 160 mil PSG have. Trent's budget uh, on Betis, which I wouldn't take that. They haven't got Sanabria, they haven't got Teo. But saying that, who wants Teo right now? But until next time, guys, goodbye.